I mean, five, it, I guess. it was four years, so you know yeah. I played against them a lot, and mm -hmm. uh, our coaches at North Texas, we had a lot of respect for that program. You know, it was the top of the conference for years and years. So, you know, I, I know him pretty well. I knew his team pretty well. So, you know, it was, it was another thing where like I seen I seen how he react to plays too. You know, I, I never seen him lose his cool. That was a big one for me because you know a coach can control the game and you know throw everybody off sometimes. And I just love how you know free this team played and you know his energy was always there. He, he's talked about that. You know, if they needed a bucket, they were going away from you defensively. Like, is that something you noticed? Is that something he, sh he shared with you? Yeah, he definitely told me that a lot of times. But I, I always thought it was just like, I mean, the whole, they, when you guard them, it's just so fast. You know, it's, I'm thinking it's just the regular offense, though. But I did notice, like, after, once he told me, I'm like, man, that makes sense. Like, you know, I was always on the opposite side of the court every time he ran up a play out of time, I was or anything like that. Okay, and then yeah, just being in in Michigan, the Midwest, uh, you know, winter has. Yeah, so like just your overall impressions of the It's cold place. already. Yeah. <laughs> it's probably 80 degrees in Texas right it's now. Uh, it's different right here. It's not I cold walk. yet. I got bad news. <laughs> <laughs> I walk out the house with a hoodie and sweatpants on every day. Like, I never let shorts or no short sleeves, shorts, nothing like that. I'm always full of everything. I'm finna get a couple coats. They told me to get a coat. I ain't got one yet, but I'm finna get a couple of them. Okay. Uh, and then how do you feel you are fitting in to all new teams? So this was kind of our first look. But yeah. I mean, I mean, I like, I like just you know his system. His system is really like free form. You know, it's not too much thinking. You you, you learn what to do in certain situations, and you just play. He lets you play like off your instincts. It's not really like, you know, you're not really looking over your shoulder trying to see what the play is. So I really like that I get to play off like my natural basketball knowledge and like play, play to my strengths, you know, instead of like trying to play to what a coach wants to do. You know? Like I get to play how I want to play. And you know, I really love everything about that. Are you. What is your position? Man, I'm, I'm always like, I, I feel like I can play any position. I, you want me to put me at five, I can play the five. Like, you know, I, I literally feel like I can play and guard any position on the court. Is that a, is playing in kind of that read and react style, is that a big change for you? Like, I, you guys all come from different systems. How's that been adjusting kind of across the board for you guys? Like, do you have to reprogram how you think about the game, or does it feel familiar? I mean, er, early on, it was a lot of like, kind of forgetting what I, what I learned a little bit. Because, like, you know, at North Texas, it was kind of play like the slowest offense in the country so like it's kind of like my first couple weeks here he was basically telling me every situation I got in like you know forget everything you learned about basketball and play to what you know now like, you know we teaching you this so do this and you know just forget everything else so, and he made it really simple for me he break it down like in so small segments and you know we play three on three two on two like we break down in smaller groups and then we go five on five so we make it easy for you to learn and is that starting to feel more natural for oh, you definitely, now? Definitely, definitely. I'm not even thinking twice right now and I know if the season goes once we get to playing other teams, it's going to definitely come on easy. What will get you taken out of a game? I mean, I know you haven't played a game yet, but what is Dusty like not about? Turnovers and things he's gonna or just like effort. Or I mean, it, I know the big one is so definitely like not getting back on defense. Like you turn the ball over, not getting back, and then like you know just having bad energy out there. You don't really put, like like your energy is contagious. So I know he, he definitely don't play that. Like you, you 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 turn the ball over your head down. Like you definitely coming out the game. Like you know you air ball a shot, you walk with your head down, something like that. Like it's, it's all about your energy. Okay. Health wise, how are you doing? I know you had a hamstring issue last year, right? And you were working through some of that. How how are you doing? Your rehab with that. Are you full go? Oh, my hamstring is great. I, I, haven't, I haven't dealt with no hamstring. I had a little, little tweak in my knee a little bit, but I've been feeling good lately. I mean, I'm staying on it as much as I can. I feel great. I feel like I'm playing every single game this year. Dusty said that today would be like nine guys you could see being in rotation. Is that competition and practice kind of pushing all you guys to that? But there are a bunch of guys that are pretty capable. I mean, not really, just because like on the, in our offense, it's so free. Like you know, the ball moves so much. And, You'll never just see somebody just playing one on one over this. So it's not really a competition aspect, more of like take advantage of the opportunity you do get. Uh, how is it playing with, with Trey? What is he like as a, as a lead guard? Uh, he, he definitely a, a true point guard. He, he loves to pass the ball. He loves to, you know, put, he, he's definitely like one of those guards that, like, you know, he, he put his energy in at first. Like, you know, he don't care how everybody else feels. He's going to put his energy out there. And, like, you know, you, he one of those guys, you kind of adapt to him. Like, you know, like, He's gonna push the ball for that. Like he loved, he loved the game and he, he showed it on the court. He played with his heart. 
you know, he, he played with a lot of energy, and I love that about him. Like, you know, he, he never bagging down for nothing. What was your familiarity with anybody on this roster before you got here? I mean, I think you know. Thank you. Vlad is probably the only person I know on this roster. Like, you know, no, I'm not really like, I've never been like a big college hoop guy. I've always been like a on the NBA and like always much off the NBA. Talking, and stuff. But Vlad literally the only player I know on this team, probably. Right? But okay. just, I guess, how. Is it, is it, I guess, 